What's up, man? Oh, it's sorry. it's your boy Lou Dizzle. I'm here at uh, Magic Box Audio headquarters with uh, the, the the Grand Tour. Yeah, might as well. Shoot. Trying to make my garage look bigger than it is. Well, the thing <laughs> is, we usually don't film in dude's garage because he's right. got like the Smithsonian of car audio. So. We we, we kind of don't want to advertise all that, but this is the uh, this is the headquarters, man. Dude does mad work in our area. He's just constantly busy uh, for the Fort Myers area. Definitely the preferred choice uh, for box builders. So uh, dropping off my Audio Technics uh, uh, Tropo tens today. Tropos. Yeah, look at that, man. I, I did the unboxing video, and it shows the direct leads. I mean, for an entry level sub. I really don't think these these can be beat, especially for the price. I mean, uh, they're a really good price. I think you'll be surprised by what I get out of them. Yeah, yeah. And uh, so I'm just gonna have them build me a box. We're talking about frequency. I like my low lows, but at the same time, they are entry level subs. So hopefully, we can get the tuning around 30, 32, something like that, just so it'll still play the low notes. But uh, I might I mean, be. If you want some lolos, we can do a uh, fourth order seawall. <laughs> yeah, right. That'd be something crazy. But Two to thirty. <laughs> well, this is this is just temporary though for now. Just to have some base. Coleman really looked out for me because I just, especially after Spring Break Nationals, I don't have the money to buy anything. So yeah, we're just gonna do a simple Magic Box prefab. Yeah, which a, which that's a prefab with birch and roundover and yep. probably an arrow. Arrow. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So. uh I take on a prefab. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, the, the the better prefabs, uh, it's nice when you can buy something that'll fit a lot of subs, but it's not tuned stupid high with 16 gauge speaker wire and yeah. a big old slot port. Eh, poop. So, yeah. well, I'm just going to show you guys a couple of the, the, the pieces of art that are around well, let me, this. Let me turn this thing right side up here. This is going to be a box for uh, four sundown. Uh, SA8B2s, which are just chilling right there. Oh, what's this in the, in the, in the oh. box here? I think it's Audio Technics OFC. Look at that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we love our Audio Technics around here. So, that bad boy is nice and stained. I mean, that's beautiful, man. That's a nice looking box. Now, this guy here, this, he, he built this box here just, just to build it. Because, uh. I was bored. Yeah. Was bored, so. Want builds something different. Builds just a, a, a sick box. Now what you see here is you guys saw this on my Facebook. That is a hundred percent completely curved port. So uh, yeah, that's definitely innovative there. Curved arrow. Curved, I call it my curved arrow. Curved arrow. Yeah. And then we got over here another box. This uh, this used to have the three Type R tens in it. Uh, again, a real nice looking box, really finished nice, round over. What was your saying? Just say no to square boxes? Yeah. Yeah, I think we'll probably end up coining that term for... Uh, say no to square. Say yeah. no to square. And then also, we got another one over here on the floor. And this this is uh, a work in progress here. This was the one I had the... Uh uh, I had the Audio Technics Stratos doing the 148.9 legal. And then I had the Sundown SA-10s um, doing the 149. Nice. And that looks like, what, about two and a half cubes there? It's right at three cubes. Oh, is it? Yeah. The Rockfords, uh, not too efficient. They don't really like that small of an enclosure. Yeah. They still play the lows decently, but... Um, <coughs> That's what it is, yeah. Mm, so, yeah. we got the mad scientists here dropping the subs off. Gonna get my box built. Gonna swap out this red wire for blue because I'm running uh, all blue wire in my build. And uh, when the box is done, I'll bring it over here and we're going to uh, find a way to cut out uh, a little bit of the firewall because Chrysler was not generous enough to include a, a uh, pass through there. So, yep, it's your boy Lou Dizzle making a little progress on the build. It's Magic Box Audio. Uh, check them out on Facebook if you're local to Fort Myers, Naples, anything like that. Uh, definitely hit this guy up for uh, a box because uh, it's affordable and uh, you're going to get better numbers. So it's your boy Lou Dizzle. Thanks for watching.